As Canadians continue to mourn the victims of the Ethiopian airplane crash, a community here in Edmonton is still trying to make sense of the tragic event, which also claimed the lives of a mother and child. 33-year-old Amina Odewa and her 5-year-old daughter Sophia Abdul Qadir were among the 157 passengers killed Sunday when their airplane crashed shortly after takeoff. She was traveling to Kenya to visit relatives. A mother of three, she leaves behind two daughters, aged seven and three. It was very shocking. Both victims were Canadians of Somali descent, members of the Ogaden Somali community in Edmonton. The group's chairman has known Amina since she was 10 years old, when they were both living in Kenya. Amina was a very loving person, visible person, very energetic and hardworking. Helping house Doris. I couldn't believe that she was here yesterday and then gone so fast. Muhammad saw his sister and niece just a day before the crash. The pair made a stop in Toronto before flying out to Ethiopia. She was the person who held the family together. People from 35 countries died in the crash six minutes after the plane took off from Ethiopia's capital en route to Nairobi, Kenya. Ethiopian Airlines said the senior pilot issued a distress call and was told to return, but all contact was lost shortly afterward. 157 lives were lost, including 18 Canadians. The Ethiopian community remains in shock. You know, when we go back home, I go often, I, we, we use Ethiopian Airlines. So for this to happen, it's, it's just uh, unthinkable. Meanwhile, Edmonton's Somali community continues to comfort Amina's mother and two surviving daughters. To visit and go to the family and convert them and, you know, share the pain with them. In Edmonton, Rochelle Sufi, City News.